Okay, um, I accepted Christ into my heart um, when I was young, around six or seven. Um, I grew up in the church and I've known uh, Christ my whole life. As a child, I grew up in a home church, pastored by my dad. Um, I've always known the Lord, he's always been with me. Um, but even though I grew up in the church, I struggled and I still struggle with them. Our home life was a battle. Parents divorced, a parent remarried. Um, my dad struggled with his health, heart attacks, diabetes, bipolar. Um, I never felt like I had control of my own life and I really desired to just have control of my own life. I just wanted to do what I wanted to do without worrying about anybody else or anything else that was going on. So I stepped away. I thought, okay, I'm, do I'm doing what I want. So I uh, moved in with a boyfriend. I'm going to school to be a teacher and I'm working at a pub and it brought a lot of hurt and heartache, um, a constant state of fight or flight. Um, Lots of fear, lots of, surrounded by a lot of toxic uh, people and relationships. Um, it, it brought a lot of sickness, physical sickness and misery into my life. Um, I, was, I was trying to support myself and pay into these bills and I was, I was doing what I wanted to do. <laughs> um, I finished school, we ended up breaking up and uh, I had a sister that graciously invited me to come live with her and her family. And that was like my first step back towards God. Um, I began praying daily and really leaning on Him and uh, healing those deep wounds that really needed some attention. Um, I would attend a service occasionally here and there, but nothing consistent. Um, and then I met my wonderful husband and we had a baby and then we got married and then I was like, oh, I want my kids to know God like I know God. And I know that they need Him in the world that we are living in now. Um, so during that, I had uh, rough pregnancies and deliveries and emergency C-sections, and I watched him bring me and carry me through so much. Uh, I never dreamed of being a stay-at-home mom, but he, he tugged on my heart, so I did that step in faith. I resigned from my job. I, I heard him calling me to join a church, so we began coming New Hope. Um, and then he tugged on my heart to dive in, get deeper, connect. So I joined a small group and I've been connecting and it's been refreshing connecting with those ladies and growing in my faith. So um, I felt the pull to get baptized, but it's hard. So then I was like, okay, let's do this. So we're doing it. <laughs> so here I am fully committed and declaring his will and his way in my life. Okay, you ready? Yep. All right. Well, since you have accepted Jesus into your heart, I want to baptize you in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Oh, thank you. Good job.